The Windows Installer service could not be accessed. This can occur if you are running Windows in safe mode or if Windows Installer is not correctly installed. Contact your support personnel for assistance. You are probably here because you have this error while trying to install Epic Games Launcher. Which is not a big deal, no one will die if you are unable to play free games that Epic releases each week. However, this error may also prevent you from installing serious software that you need to work to earn money to feed yourself, and in this case, someone may die if he or she is not able to complete work, get paid and buy food. Anyway, I assume you are not running Windows in safe mode. I assume you have all Windows updates installed. I assume you are using 64-bit version of Windows and I assume you have followed multiple online tutorials to fix this error only to see nothing helps. So the error obviously has something to do with Windows installer service. Even if this service is running correctly, it is a good idea to re-register it. You have to open command prompt with administrative privileges, first unregister, then register back the 64-bit version of um, this service, which is conveniently located in System32 directory, and with the second two commands you have to register the 32-bit version of the same service, which is conveniently located in WoW64 folder. That's Microsoft logic for you. Actually, there is a background for that to enable compatibility with old programs, which do not know that System32 now contains 64-bit files. Anyway, after you do that, you should also run two commands, which are copy-pasted over and over and over and over again as a cure it all for all Windows problems at places like the official Microsoft community. Anyway, in this particular case, they might work. So you have to first run this dism command, and after that you should run the sfc scan now command. They may take a while to complete. Do not shut down your PC and wait until the commands finish. Your PC should also be connected to the internet the entire time. After they finish, restart your PC, and this time the setup files should launch just fine. I am the god of YouTube. Like, subscribe, thanks, jingle bells.